Facts Verse presents Life Hacks You Can Actually Use. Number 1. Charge Your Phone Faster This is one of the many life hacks you can actually use. There's nothing more frustrating than when you need to leave the house soon and your phone is completely dead. Rather than waiting over an hour for your phone to charge, you should put your phone on airplane mode. You might not be able to get calls or texts, but it will charge your phone twice as fast. It will also get you out the door much faster and you'll have a full charge on your battery. Number 2. Easily tell which side your gas tank is on Have you ever borrowed a friend's car and it needed gas? Have you ever bought a new car and you needed to gas it up for the first time? If you have, chances are you forgot to check which side of the car that gas tank is on before you got in it. Well, most people who forgot to check will lean out the window looking for the gas tank or get out of the car to find it. You really don't need to do that, though. On the gas gauge, next to the gas pump icon is an arrow. Whichever way that arrow is pointing is the side of the car that the gas tank is located on. Number 3. The Best Time of Year to Buy Something if you want to make a relatively major purchase but you're afraid to buy at the wrong time of the year when prices are the highest, Lifehacker.com has created a list so that you can figure out the best month of the year to purchase these items. The list will tell you which months are the best for making what purchases. This can save you thousands of dollars each year. Number 4. Turn Your Smartphone Into a Macro Lens have you ever wanted to take a close-up picture but you don't have an expensive camera? What would you do if the only camera that you own is on your cell phone? Well, if this ever happens, you can actually turn your cell phone's camera into a macro lens. All you need is a small magnifying glass, a bobby pin, and a piece of scotch tape. Start by placing the magnifying glass over the camera's lens. Next. Hold the magnifying glass in place with the opening of the bobby pin and tape the bobby pin to the phone. Soon, you can take photos of the smallest details in objects. It's much cheaper than buying a professional camera. Number 5. Prevent shoulder bumps in your sweatshirts or sweaters If you ever hung up a sweatshirt or a sweater on a hanger, whether wet or dry, well, you know about those bumps that suddenly appear in the shoulders where the tips of the hanger stick out. If you want to keep that from happening, you can hang your shirt in a different way. Start with the shirt spread out on the bed and then fold it in half. Next, put the hanger's hook in the armpit of the shirt and fold the arm over the hanger and then fold the body of the sweater over the hanger. You'll never need to worry about shoulder bumps again. Number 6. Prevent Orange Fingers When Eating Cheetos most people love the taste of Cheetos, but they hate the fact that they get orange fingers when they eat them. Even if you lick your fingers after each bite, you can still expect a mess. The best way to keep this from happening is to eat your Cheetos with chopsticks. It's a classy, less messy way to enjoy this delicious snack. Number 7. Protect Your Checks If you have a check that needs to be cashed, it's important to protect it from the rain and from being ripped or creased. To do this, put a small piece of cardboard in a Ziploc bag. The check will be safe from the rain in the bag, and the cardboard will help to keep its shape. It's a genius idea. Number 8. Deboning a Chicken Wing Do you love chicken wings but you hate munching around the bone? Well, no longer a problem if you listen to me. If you want to easily debone your wing so that you can get a big piece of chicken in each bite, the technique is simple. Start by pulling the cartilage off at the end. Next, work out the small bone, and it's all meat after that. Now you can really enjoy those wings. Number 9. Stop hammering your thumb Oh yeah, we've all done it. Trying to hang a picture on the wall and then BOOM! Smack our thumb with the hammer in the process. And of course we let out a few choice four-letter words, and then we swear we're never going to do it again. And then we do it again. Well, if, if you've not done this, well, you are definitely in the minority. Many people who don't have much experience with hammers have done this, yours truly included. Well, to save your thumb and your pride, all you need is a clothespin. Rather than holding the nail with your hand, hold it with the clothespin. If you miss the nail, who cares? You only hit the clothespin, not your thumb. Number 10. Stack Your Clothes Vertically 
When you fold your clothes and put them in your drawers in the traditional fashion, it can be difficult to keep your drawers neat for very long. As soon as you go looking for a shirt that is located at the bottom of the drawer, things can get messy and unfolded. If you fold your clothes and put them in the drawer vertically, you'll be able to see everything right when you open up the drawer. There'll be no longer a need to rifle through the drawers looking for that one single perfect shirt. Number 11. Maximize the space under your sink. If you're like most people, you keep lots of items under the kitchen sink. This includes cleaning products, gardening products, pest control products, that copy of the Declaration of Independence you stole once, the neighbor's dog that wouldn't shut up when you were doing a voiceover for facts first so you had to dog nap it and then tape its mouth shut just to keep it quiet. Anyway, I'm getting off track here. Anyway, a lot of the products under the kitchen sink, well, they have a trigger nozzle, which is great for saving space. All you need is a spring-mounted shower curtain rod. Install the rod under the sink and hang all the products with a trigger nozzle from the bar. It's a great way to free up space for the products that don't have a trigger nozzle. Yeah, I wonder if I can hang the dog from that, too. Number 12. How to cook corn without making a mess. I love corn on the cob, how about you? But I hate chucking the corn and then waiting for it to cook. Well, apparently, I don't have to worry about that anymore. You can cook a fresh ear of corn from start to finish in just a little over four minutes. You start by putting the corn, skin and all, in the microwave. Cook it for about four minutes, and then next, cut the corn at the end. Squeeze the corn out. It's going to be hot, so you should be careful, but what you'll have is a cooked piece of corn without the hairy stalk stuck to it. It's simple. Number 13. Keep your bathroom smelling great. If you're like most people, you'll want your bathroom to always smell good. Keeping a candle lit 24 hours a day or spraying air freshener constantly, well, they're not the most convenient of ideas, not to mention kind of expensive. Well, instead, put a few drops of your favorite scented essential oil onto the cardboard tube of the toilet paper. This will keep your bathroom smelling great until it's time to replace the roll. Number 14. Peel a banana the right way. Bananas can be difficult to peel. You could have a banana that opens easily and another that won't. To always peel a banana as quickly and easily as possible, make sure that you peel it the right way. Start by squeezing the banana until it starts to crack. Next, just peel it apart. You'll never need to worry about eating a squished banana again. This is actually how the monkeys do it. I mean, come on, how many times have you ever seen a monkey struggling with a banana? My point exactly. Subscribe for more. Uh-oh. I hear somebody at the door. I think my neighbor knows about the dog.